Hey, what's up everyone? Glock9 here and welcome back to Trapped in Higashi. It is the night of day 39 and we are about to take on a demolisher only horde. Had to do it. It's the only way we could possibly get what we need. We might not even get what we need, who knows? But I had to try this. Now, one thing to note, I could not get the 100% loot bag mod to work alongside the demolisher only mod. So not every demolisher is going to drop a bag. But even still, we should see more red bags tonight than we've seen throughout the entirety of the series. Question is, are we going to survive the night and be able to loot them? I don't know. Is the base going to survive? Probably not. Is the building gonna survive? Well, if I start triggering buttons, then definitely not. So with that said, I'm gonna try my best to have patience and take them out one at a time. Cause, you know, one demolisher can set off another, and then a chain reaction starts, and that is not good. <laughs> we do not want that to happen. There's some bags falling. All right, so far it doesn't seem too bad. Problem is, demolishers hit really hard, so they're gonna make light work of this base. I'm just gonna try and take out as many as I can before they take out this structure. And then, uh, if or when they do take out this structure, we could run for the second floor. Problem is, when we do that, they might start attacking the walls, and who knows, even if we don't trigger any buttons, they could still possibly take this building down. But no risk, no reward, baby! There we go. Oh, yeah. Don't get cocky now. <laughs> oh, shit. Did I get him? All right, I got him. Oh, that was a close one. They're really chewing into this main area. Let's move over here. We can get some stragglers to come to us. So we're not dealing with such a crowd. Now I did try and connect like the main area of this base to the walls. This way if they do chew through the entire thing, maybe it still won't fall. I don't know. I think we're gonna find out though. <laughs> nice. Oh shit. What the hell? That block almost fell right on my head. Landed right in front of me. Damn. They are wrecking shit. This really is a test of my patience, because you have no idea how bad I just want to pull out the M60 right now and let loose. But I know that will only end in devastation. Oh shit. Uh, let's get up here. And see how they behave if we hang out, like, right over here. Yeah, there's plenty of them back here to take out. I should have put some bars in right here. I could have connected this platform to the back wall using the scaffolding bars. That would have been a good idea. Too bad I'm thinking of it now. So we're getting some of them to attack the back wall here. I'm sure because I'm standing where I'm standing. But it's not too many of them, so I'm not worried about it yet. I'll move if it gets too crazy. Look at this group forming right underneath me, though. They're trying to World War Z their way up to me. That's not bad, actually. Keeps them busy. Keeps them doing something other than breaking blocks. This is nice, actually. Fuck yeah, dude. Uh, now they're getting a little crazy. You know what? Let's move. Let's go back here. And we can hop back and forth. Keep them confused. Keep them moving around. Oh, shit. Well, that was just bad timing on my part. 
Uh, the steps here, I raised this up, but I put a ladder in right there. So it's a little more of a risky jump for me. But they shouldn't be able to get up that way. Oh, no! Shit! 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 Okay, the chain reaction has stopped. That was pretty rough, though. Let's see uh, how the building reacts. Doesn't seem to have liked that very much. Is it done falling apart? No, it is not done. It, It is just getting started. Oh, rebuilding this isn't going to be fun. Plenty of stone to harvest, though. We don't have to worry about getting down in the mine. Gotta look on the bright side of life sometimes. Oh, shit. They're using the rubble to get up here, and we are fucked. Um, this is not good. Uh, I can pop the hatch up. And we can survive here for about 30 seconds. Uh, I just want that red bag. Can I get that red bag? I just want to see if there's an engine inside before I die. Oh, fuck me. I can't go that way. Well, I think the stairs are out, so that's the good news. Hey, red bag. I want that bag. Engine? No. <laughs> four by four truck accessories. We have the chassis. That's nice. Now all we need is an engine and a battery. The stairs are not destroyed, so once they break through those blocks, like that, now they can get up here. Maybe not after that guy blows up. And the next guy. And that guy. Shit. Alright, I think we're safe up here now. Hey, look, no engine. Uh, can I finish eating, buddy? Oh, he's dead. Holy shit balls. How we looking? No stairs. Good. We're nice and safe up here. As long as... Oh, shit! No! All right, then. Uh, we can use the rubble to get up this way. And we can get up to the double doors. Even though the staircase is crumbling right now. Yeah, I don't think this is going to work. Here we go. We can get up this way, maybe. Jump. Shit. There we go. Come on. Damn it. I should have put more points into parkour. Well, we don't want to get up too high anyway, because we want to still be able to kill demolishers. We can't just let them run amok down there. We got to continue to eliminate them. Building is continuing to crumble. How about right there? Okay. No, no, do not get buried alive. That would be the worst thing. Okay, from here, I can continue murdering. Don't really give a shit about hitting buttons at this point. Fuck it. That's probably the only way we're gonna take the mob out. Is by blowing most of them up. Oh, no. Uh, fellas, can we talk about this? I need to kill them, because I really don't have anywhere to run. Okay, one down. Shit! Oh, no, I did not mean to do that. Oh, boy. Let me get back up here. Jump! Damn it! Let's try that. One more time. Nope. Luckily for me, this is my element. This is where I shine, baby. These are the nights I live for. This is the this is what makes this game great. Okay. Here we go. Yes. Fuck you, demolishers. 
Even if we make it through the night, we're really going to have to dig through some rubble to get all the damn loot bags. And I don't have any tools on me. All my tools are in storage. I don't even want to think about what's going on with the storage right now and if everything is safe. Watch, you know what my luck is? I'll make it through the night, I'll find an engine and a battery and gas, and then all the things in storage will be destroyed. <laughs> and, then, and then what? Oh, man. This is awesome. Uh-oh! No! No, no, no! Fuck off! Uh, I'm gonna have to use the cobblestone blocks to get up here. All right. Here we go. Yes. Commence with the killing. Whoops. Eh, fuck it. Let her rip. Only an hour until morning, we could make it. Holy shit. That wall didn't make it. All right. Then the north wall is gone. We got three more. Gotta look on the bright side. The glass is three quarters of the way full. That's how I look at it. You might think all is lost. All isn't lost. We're still alive. We still got almost 2,000 rounds of ammo. We're fine. We get all these demolishers killed, we got plenty of loot to go through, and we got three more days to rebuild the entire building. We don't even need to rebuild the entire building. Just a little bit of it. The destruction, the chaos, I live for that shit. You know what would really destroy morale for me? If we survive the night, go through the bags, and still don't find anything we need. Then I'm out. I'm done at that point. Oh shit, all this rubble is gonna give them a way up here. It's gonna turn into a game of King of the Mountain. I need to get some to blow up right here to destroy this pile of rubble so they don't have a way up here. There we go. All right, we're safe for now and it's officially morning. We did it, success. <laughs> this is what success looks like if you're wondering. Plenty of loot bags down there. We just need spelunking gear to find them all. Oh shit. Damn it. Well, all right then. We gotta try not to fall down into little crevices here. We gotta stay on top of the rubble. That's how we win. There we go. I want them to blow up at this point. That's the only way we're going to take them all out. It's by getting them to blow up and blow others up. There we go. Look at this. No problem. Uh, fuck off, buddy. He's on fire. <laughs> we got two walls left. Almost two walls. One and a half, let's call it. Asshole. Die. All right. I want to get back up here. This seems like the highest point. That's fun. Oh, this is awesome. I could rebuild. I've dealt with worse. Look at this fucking chair right here. That's a king's chair if I've ever seen one. This is my iron throne right here. Get... Whoop. Never mind. 
Well, I would like to see if uh, the bunker and all my stuff is still intact, but there are just way too many demolishers around to try that just yet. Let's repair this M60. And get up here. Uh, let's put in some blocks, otherwise I'm going to fall. Oh, and the demolishers are following me up. Oh, this is a dead end. Shit. Oh, not good. No. Okay, that one's dead. Oh, we gotta go. Fuck. Yes. Well, this just might be my masterpiece. Well, I mean, the horde is dealt with, but the demolishers keep coming because we're in the middle of a wasteland city. We have no walls. We're making a shit ton of noise. So I don't know if we're going to be able to get to the point where it's quiet and we can actually take our time and loot. I mean, look at this. It's like a whole nother horde coming. I got to get up here. All right, can breathe a little easier now. Oh, this might be a problem. Uh-oh. Think it's time to move. Let's get over here. Okay, now we're safe. Getting them to blow up is such an easier way to take them out, but it's kind of like a double-edged sword because the more explosions, the, the more demolishers we're attracting. It's just a vicious cycle. Well, the more I kill, the more show up. And my ammo is slowly dwindling. So at some point, very soon, I'm going to have to jump down there and start going through the bags for ammo. Oh, shit. Well, okay. No time like the present. Here we are. Oh, damn. The rubble is collapsing. Just trying to get to a high point so I can see what's going on and see the demolishers coming for me. This is, uh, we are over the area where the bunker is. I think we can get down there, but not with this many demolishers around. Oh, shit. I think the bunker might be safe. All the rubble fell on top of, like, the main floor, protecting it, sort of. Well, that was a fail. I need to make more cobblestone blocks. I do have more cobblestone on me, so I can do that. Nice. Okay. <laughs> this is hilarious. All this shit, we better find something, man. Engine, battery, something. Give me something, you know? I'll tell you what, what an epic fucking ending if we actually pull this off. Uh, fuck you. Can you imagine? Can you imagine if we found all the things we needed and then I built a platform and we flew out of here with the building completely demolished? It would be the most epic ending to a series ever. Shit. I think we're right above the bunker. It's right over here. Right down there. I just can't... I just can't go down there yet. Ow. 
Oh my goodness. This is never gonna end, is it? I'm never gonna get them all dealt with. Doesn't mean I'm gonna stop trying, though. Alright, we gotta start digging into these bags. There's some ammo. There we go. There we go. Oh, shit. That mechanic is a problem. <laughs> Where they start running at you once you trigger their button. Excuse me. Vitamin, alright. Hey, now we can't be infected. Keep it on the bright side. Gotta look on the bright side of life. A little more ammo. Beautiful. Yes. All right. Done. I win. Oh, yeah. Well, you know what's good about this series is we completely proved that a loot bag only series would be absolutely fucking terrible. Got more incoming. Recog. Oh shit, six recogs. I kept forgetting to use them. Oh, yeah. Ammo supply looking good. I could do this all day. Ow. Oh, we better move. See the last one? Uh, two of them? There goes that guy. Uh, three of them? All right. It's kind of quiet. That's good. Let's go see uh, if we can get into the bunker now. Uh, got another demolisher. Look, there's the ladder right down there. All right, I'm going. Fuck it. Oh, shit. Well, all my stuff was in that box, including all the brass. That's a shame. Well, I don't think we're going to find an engine anyway. I don't know if it just that's just the way it is now and you just can't find an engine or a battery in these bags. Even though someone said, you know, Josh was playing a Demolisher only series and someone said he pulled an engine out of um, one of his bags. But who knows if he had some other mods installed or whatever. I didn't want to change anything. I didn't want to change the ratio of, you know, whatever, make it more common to find an engine. The point of this was to see if we could do it without changing anything except for of course the amount of loot bags we got because i figured that would just speed things along but even with the hundred percent loot drop and uh even now with all these damn red bags we're just not finding the shit so i don't know if it's just my piss poor luck 
Or if it's just fucking damn near impossible, or what? Hey, level six Desert Eagle. All I had to do was destroy the whole fucking building to find one. Level six auto shotgun. This fucking game. The game's like, oh, the whole building's destroyed now? Well, here's some stuff you could have used two weeks ago. I'm sure there are more bags buried underneath all this rubble, but come on. I must have searched a hundred bags. No oh, shit. Damn, dog. Startled me. <laughs> Not that I'm scared of dying from the dog. It was just like he screamed right in my face. So, you know, I'm not going to go crazy. I'm not going to go digging through this rubble for even more bags. I mean, I think I've proven that either my particular save and world is broken in terms of the, you know, random loot found in bags or it's just broken all around. Things need to be adjusted, I think. Unless that's the way they want it, you know? I mean, the game is not meant to be played inside one POI. Let's keep that in mind. I mean, if you want to do it just to see how long you can survive in there, that's great. But if you actually want to give yourself a goal, like build a gyrocopter and escape, then you're going to have to use mods. Because uh, otherwise you're just not going to get all the things you need. This entire wall is being held up by one block. Unbelievable. Well, we did it. Took down the entire building. Hey, how could we be trapped inside of a building if there is no building? Huh? Didn't think of that one, did you? Well, what should we do now? Dig up some dirt? Make cobblestone? <laughs> I don't think so. Well, there are no walls left. Like I said, nothing's keeping us trapped in here now. The only trap I want to be in is the booby trap. Yeah, that's what I can go for. A beer and a lap dance. Fuck it, I earned it. Come on, fellas. Let's go. Beers and lap dances. I'm paying. It's on me. Where are the ladies? Oh, just you assholes in here? Well, ain't this a bitch. 